These are my memories from Ibuwe Elementary School. I remember in kindergarten when we all made paper mache fish. We learned all about the habitats of fish and how they need water to survive. We read books about fish. Then we made a big painting with all the fish using bright colors like pink, blue, purple, and green. We invited all the parents to show them all the things that we learned about fish. I remember in first grade, we learned how to write poetry, a special kind called haiku. A haiku has five syllables in the first line, seven syllables in the second line, and five syllables in the last line. We wrote down our poems and drew drawings and then hung them in the hallway for everyone in the school to see. I remember in second grade, I realized how much I loved music. Our music teacher's name was Mr. Long. He taught us the song Do a Deer and all the hand motions for Do, Re, Mi, Fa, So, La, Ti, and Do. He also taught us how to read music using quarter notes and eighth notes. We had a big concert where we sang Do a Deer for our parents and then drank hot chocolate after. I remember in third grade we had class permit class. My teacher gave me the special job of coming in early each morning to make sure their water was clean. We kept the hermit crab in the, in the back of the classroom in a big kiddie pool. In the beginning I was so scared. My heart was beating so hard I thought that it would come out of my throat. But after holding them every day I got used to it and even became brave enough to hold them in my hands for five minutes long. I remember in fourth grade, I read the book, The Wizard of Oz. I loved the book so much that I read all the books in the series in one day. I loved the book so much that I dressed up as one of the main characters, the Scarecrow, for a Halloween play. Reading The Wizard of Oz made me realize how much I loved reading fantasy books. I remember in fifth grade, I made a science project about tornadoes. We learned all about severe weather patterns. Then we learned how to make a science project by making a hypothesis, doing an experiment, and writing about what we found. I presented my tornado science project at the fifth grade science fair. I remember in fifth grade, our gym teacher, Mr. Barrett, taught us how to play soccer. At first, I was really bad. I even scored a goal on my own team. I always got placed last when we made teams, and I felt really sad but I kept doing my best and by the end of the year, I was actually a pretty good soccer player. This was an important life lesson and perseverance that I learned. I want to thank all the teachers that I had. Miss Mina taught me all the letters of the alphabet in kindergarten. Mrs. Huff taught me how to make the greater than and less than signs with the fish eating the bigger number in first grade. Mrs. Caviani taught me how to write interesting stories with the beginning, middle, and end. Mrs. Shuffler taught me how to multiply. Mrs. Peters taught me how to conduct a scientific experiment. Mr. Long taught me how to read music. Mr. Barrett taught me how to play soccer. And how could I ever forget Mr. Hill who taught me to draw a self-portrait? Thank you to my parents who helped me with my homework and brought me my lunch or homework if I forgot it at home. And thank you to my friends who always included me and made sure I didn't feel left out. Congratulations, Ibuwe Elementary Class of 2000. We did it.